going to be a shorter video today everyone this is uh, part two day two hall four and three eh? we'll keep this one a bit shorter we've just got a few cars in hall four and then we've got the barn fine section the ford rs owners club nice four by four escort there Escort cars are hiding behind there. That, uh, at least at time of filming, is commanding some hefty prices. Lovely XR2. The XR Owners Club next to it. Gorgeous Mexico. This is the one that took my eye on the last video, this video. Cheshire Capri Club. Breathed on by Tickford. Lovely 2.18. Piranha Car Owners Club. Old Granny. Fourteen and Mark Free Club. Next to a Capri 280s club, or Capri 280 group, even. XR4 register. XR owners club. I do love a Mark 1 XR2. Look at that. Footman James stand. So starting with a Lotus Elite. Corniche. That is a 356, albeit not complete. Healy Westland Roadster. Obviously, an imp. Not just any imp. 1976 XRAC rally car. Nineteen sixty-seven Land Rover, owned by Tom Rafferty. Jaguar XK120. A little Lotus Sedan S3 and a little Topolino. And the Series 1 E type. I think I can understand why they broke that one off. Right, let's have a look at the barn finds. I love the barn finds. Or basket cases, some of them I would call. We have a 71 Austin 3 litre ambulance. Next to an Alfetta. I'm looking around here because I think I, yep. Lovely. We like Scimitar. SE6A 1977. Night 72 Rover P6. Okay. 
He's holding air in the tyres, everyone. Two door courting. Mark one. Picking the windscreen in a gaffer type. Chevrolet Styline Sedan, 1952. Ford Console, GT. Four litre. Next to a Cavalier convertible. Looks like it's already been pillaged for parts for another car, doesn't it? I love this section of the show. Corsair. Next to a uh, Austin A60 van. Unusual boot on that Mini. Andy, Andy Longfield's 1960 Mini 850. And we have a Scimitar GTE. Next to a Land Rover Series 2. I was expecting that to be an ambulance. Ford Capri, of course. Calypso. We had the Calypso and the Laser. That one is the Calypso. Can't miss this big old thing, can we? Look. Look at that. when it's looking a little tiny bit better. Jaguar Mark IV, 1947. The MG Magnet, or Magneti, 1954. You know what they say on the forums, don't they? Just needs a bit of tea cut. The Jowett, Javelin. This one's a 1952 Deluxe. Wolseley 1500 and the last one's a, another Mini 850 that completes the bar find area everyone Ford100e.com I like what it says on that windscreen Transit. It's quite heavily customised that one. The Cruiser Van Company. Early pop top. I love this Ford here. Ford Side Valve Owners Club. Beautiful that is. How's that for a gorgeous old commercial? Special bodied Ford E83W van. Tickford Owners Club is um, well that early has rightly got dust covers on but the Puma Racing's out 
Then you got United Kingdom Probe Owners Club. Next to some very expensive Fords again, everyone. RS500 Owners Club. Definitely a telephone call to the bank to buy one of these at the moment. Nice though. Splendid Mark 1 Fiesta here, yeah. look at that. Sure I've seen this one before, doing the rounds, but again, look at the condition. Fantastic. Next to a lovely dog bone escort. With, of course, a mandatory model of the sign. Ford Corsair anniversary, 60 years. So you got the Ford Corsair Owners Club. Definitely some restoration required here. More racing Pumas. A little Walsley Hornet convertible. Ford Classic and Console Capri. So many ways to go and spend your money over there. So I'll try and avoid that one for now. Like I said in the, the, the larger, the bigger first video, what's your favourite car on this video today, everyone? Leave it in the comments. Got some for sale cars, including Morgan. Plymouth Prowler. Mondial Cotravoli, I'm going to pronounce that wrong now. 19, 1982 Mini Moke. <laughs> and another dog bone escort. £45,000 to you. And another RS Cosworth. Griffiths Imports. MX-5 Owners Club That one Marcus Owners Club These ones will be for sale, of course. Some more lovely Fords for sale, including a two door Corti again, 50 grand. So, this is your Silverstone Auctions.
Did go to the Silverstone auctions just before Christmas. I haven't purchased something that's not been revealed on the channel yet, everyone. To get in, you need to pay £10 for the catalogue. It was £5 at the local auction that Silverstone was running when I was there before Christmas. But, you know, captive audience. Sunbeam Stiletto, so a bit of a slopey back coupe version. Do you know, I said we'll keep this one shorter and we have, I'll keep, I'll end it there. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this, remember to hit the thumbs up, it helps the channel. And if you're not subscribed, there's a link that's going to be there in a few seconds, it's completely free. If you click on it again, it helps build the channel and we value your support. That was a practical classics car show, everyone. A restoration show at the NEC in Birmingham 2023. See you soon.